I was considered the regular artist for the series. Yeah, I yeah. drew 36 and a half of the 55 issues nice. of Teen Titans Go. And they gave it to you probably because you were working on Young Justice? Yes. Yeah, yeah. personally, one of my first comics I ever read. Oh, yeah. I ever read. <laughs> I got it in the mail as a subscription. Oh, awesome. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. I did that when I was a kid. I started with Uncanny X Men mail subscription. I love seeing all the new shows pulling from all these elements. From yeah. The series. Happy Harbor, uh, yeah. Red Tornado. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Is Life yeah. be coming soon? What? I think so. They See, I don't have the DC yeah. Universe really, uh, account, so I can't watch it yet. Momo lost the finger, and then the after credits starts to move. Oh, dude, that would be <laughs> awesome. It was so fun seeing Secret and Harm, like, yeah, in an animated yeah. set. Yes. version so that was a thrill having co-created both those characters so to see my version of team lobo in some form whether it's yeah. little lobo or slobo whichever way, way they go yeah. i think slobo is the more interesting character because he was the runt of the litter his body was degrading so he put on this air of lobo where really he was completely insecure inside i'd like that is perfect especially for teens because we all struggle slobo was his own character i really loved what we, we're doing with him, I wish we had more time to do more with him. We're doing a video on, on the Teen Titans show and by extension. Yeah, the comic. Like, I, I notice you throw in a lot of like random slowbo Easter eggs, like he'll be on a on a uh, b- billboard in the background yeah. or something. That's yeah. a lot of fun. I've been tr- I, as soon as I notice that, I'm like, damn it! Now I have to find these every time, like so I can try to. I go. love putting in Easter eggs <laughs> yeah. whenever I can. That, that's appropriate for yeah. sure. And near, near the end of the series, you brought in Wonder Girl. And yes. Characters yeah. Who actually, in the show. Right. Like, I guess you have to design her. Actually, Glenn Murakami did did a design for her, and so we just followed his lead. Since he designed everyone else, let's keep the whole Murakami vibe going. I got to design the Cassie Sandsmark Wonder Girl Mm -hmm. in the Teen Titans Go style, and the Team Titans, Flame Bird and and, uh, Mirage and all those. I designed them, taking their DC Universe look, and then putting it through the Teen Titans cartoon filter. There's one issue where the the Tim style Justice League shows up. Was there like a, a consciousness that like this happened within that universe as well? Or, or I think someone else might have drawn yeah, that issue. Yeah, they definitely so. did. Yeah, we're just curious if you had any insight at all. I, do, I don't. <laughs> and if I did, I probably promptly forgotten it. <laughs> yeah, because that was like ten years ago yeah, yeah, that yeah. that yeah. series ended. Yeah. It's hard to believe it was that long. It feels yeah. like just yesterday I was drawing yeah. those comics. Yes. Be sure to follow me on my YouTube channel, uh, YouTube.com/slash Totnock, for tons of art videos, 200 plus. So plenty of, of videos of me drawing pencils, inks, Copic color, and watercolor.